Hi everyone and welcome to Mighty Kiddos. I'm very excited today to be sharing some of the things I will be putting in my kids' Easter basket. As a child development specialist, I'm always looking for unique things to put in there and I wanna share a few of those things with you. I always wanna put something fun, something healthy, something cool, and something that's gonna help them learn. So here we go with the first thing is for them to learn in a fun way and that is books, okay? I do wanna share that these are books that I've put together. I I've made and they are now available on Amazon so I will link them below and this is the coloring book this is perfect perfect for little hands that are learning how to scribble and the purpose behind this coloring book I know there's tons of them on Amazon and everywhere but this one is more geared towards toddlers and encouraging their language development so it's going to be super cool to have baby Z coloring on here now I have this book here for for JT. JT tends to struggle a little bit with anxiety, which I will be talking about in later videos. So if you're interested in child anxiety, make sure you're subscribed and you hit the notification button so you don't miss future videos. But this grateful and thankful journal, it is so cute. I went ahead and added some positive affirmations throughout this book. They could draw something here. There's very different prompts in each page, so it's not something boring. This is really to help other children out there to cultivate that feeling of gratitude and being thankful and just understanding that their mindset can control the way their day is gonna come out. Okay, so this is for them. Now for my kiddos, for the families I work with, that a lot of them aren't talking. I highly suggest these books. Oh my gosh, they're beautiful. I love them. Um, they have very simple words. So they show you the sign language. They show you the, the feeling or the face or something simple about it. I think they go for, I, I want to say $20 or something. So it is a little pricey, but trust me, it is very important because you're giving them a, word, a way to communicate. So this would be a great, great tool for an autistic kiddo. You put it in their basket and add it with more of their special interest things. I really suggest this. I will link her website in the description below. Of course, kids love toys and mine are boys and they always love cars. So I got tons of Hot Wheels at the Dollar Tree. Can you believe it? They're $1.25. I got a bunch of these. Now, when putting things in your kid's basket, think about toys that they like and that they will play with and that you could also use it for their development. With cars, we use it for sound effects, beep, 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 wee, 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 all those things. We also use them for counting since we have so many of them. And when we have bigger ones and little ones, we can also talk about size. So think about that. How can you give your child something um, that can also help for their development and be fun at the same time? Now, obviously we did books. Now we have cars, but we can't forget about the writing utensils. And the one I'm so excited to give Baby Z is this one. It comes with 36 colors and I love it because, well, this one's not open, but it's it writes really smoothly. And over here in the back, it says it's three in one. So it's a crayon, it's a pastel, and then also you could put water on it to make it change into like a watercolor. So I'm really excited to have Baby Z explore a little bit more of color and texture with this box. Now for JT, for his grateful gratitude journal, I got him a set of gel pens. I feel like with gel pens of different colors, with glitter and everything, it's going to motivate him to write with a different color each day and just make the journal his own and you know show his personality in that way. Now the last thing, of course, kids are looking forward to are snacks. And I'm getting them these. This is a really cool brand. Um, they have, what, three grams of sugar per bag, okay, for the whole entire bag. Only three grams of sugar, so I don't feel guilty giving them these. Here, baby, go have a bag. Um, and they're plant-based, so it's very healthy. Um, they don't have any of the harmful color dyes that we normally see in, in candies, and they taste so good. They are very chewy, so if you have an oral seeker like I do, like Baby Z, these are really satisfying to chew on. Now, the last toy I want to share with you is something cool, which is going to be the aha, like wow, um, part of their basket. And it's these glow pals. They're so cool cool. Um, they're actually little, they look like ice cubes and they already have a battery in there and they get activated when you put it in the water. So as you put it in the water, the cubes turn on. Right now they're having a sale up until I think April 3rd where you can get 20% off on any of their items on their website. So make sure you visit that because you will not regret it. It's going to be a really cool toy that I'm sure your kids are going to enjoy. So there you have it guys. This is what I will be putting in my kids Easter basket this year. 
I hope you liked it. Have a good day. Bye.